Hi guys, it's John Hullawatty here from the Body Camp. Welcome to the Inferno workout. Okay, all you need for this workout is your bodies and a stopwatch. The idea of the workout is you're going to work continually for 10 minutes non stop. The first exercise we're going to do is press ups. So, what you want to do, you've got two options. You can do full press ups, just line your shoulders up, push the weight over onto your arms, and then just drop in and squeeze up. Bring your body down as low as you can. You're going to do 10 reps of that. An alternative is on your knees from there where you go three quarter press up. Your arms are nice and wide again and you're leaning in as low as you can and push up. Squeezing the abs in at the same time and pushing through the triceps. If you want to make it even easier than that, you can bring your butt in and go into box press ups. Stick your butt up in the air and drop down as far as you can, squeezing up at the top. Okay, you're going to do that 10 reps. Once you've done this, you go straight into squats. Your feet are going to go nice and wide. You drop down, touch the floor, squeezing through the abs, bringing the shoulders back, looking forward at the top, squeezing your butt cheeks in as well, locking those abs, breathing out at the top. Try and get in as low as you can. If your range of movement is only there, that's cool, but as you carry on with this workout and you get more into it, you will be able to do even more um, speed on these workouts and get lower. So eventually you'll be trying to get in as low as you can, touching down into the floor in between your feet. Okay, the next exercise we're going to do is renegade rows. Similar to press up, in that position that you're nice and wide on the arms, squeezing through the abs, just bring your right arm in as close as you can to your body, squeezing the lats there, and then back down, and back in. So one, two, three, four, up to ten, and then you're done. An alternative for that is just do it on your hands and knees if you want. So the same thing, but on your hands and knees. Once you've done that one, we go straight into lunges. Okay, you just stride forward, bending that back knee, pushing back, alternating. Now a little trick you can use if you want to work your quads more, here you can lift your arms up above your head every time you lunge. Okay, squeezing the abs in as well, five on each side, alternating legs. If you want to work your butt more, you can take your hands down with you and drop in. Okay. You might lose your balance a little bit as I did there, but that's cool. You will improve as you do. Okay, lunging in again and just dropping your hands. It just works your butt a little bit more than it would as a normal lunge. You're going to repeat that 10 times uh, for 10 minutes. So you're going to go 10 reps of press ups, 10 reps of squats, 10 reps of rows, 10 reps of lunges, then back round to your 10 press ups. You're going to do that for 10 minutes. When your alarm goes off on your phone or your stopwatch, whatever you've used, then you get a one to three minute rest depending on your fitness levels, okay? Once you've had your little break, I mean, you don't even have to have a rest if you're super, super hardcore, you can go straight into the next one. Okay, once you've had your rest, you go straight into the next set. It's exactly the same format, so it's 10 minutes long. You set your watch again or on your phone on your alarm and you go 10 prone rotations. So from here, arms are nice and wide, squeezing through the abs, you're just going to rotate your body round, take your head with you, squeeze through the abs, back down, there's one rep, back round across to the other side, that's two, there's your third, again you can do it on the knees if you want, so drop your body in and just turn from there. So there's a couple of alternatives, again try and build up to the next level as well, once you've done those ten, you're going to go into squat jumps. So you touch the floor, jump up as high as you can, bending the knees, landing with soft knees every time. If squat jumps are a bit much for you, you can do prison squats. So you're sitting as low as you can and just squeeze through the abs. Ten of those as well guys, once you've done those ten, you're going to shoulder press. No weights, just smash them out as fast as you can. So one, two, three, four, five, up to ten, job done on those and we're going to plank lift. From here, you're going to lock into a plank. You're going to push up and extend through the tricep, then drop back down. So lifting your body up from a plank position. Get your 10 out, and then you're back to the start where you're on your prone rotations. So again, 10 prone rotations, 10 squat jumps, 10 shoulder press, 10 plank lifts. Okay, well done. 
take your rest, and then we've got the final round. Again, we're starting with 10 burpees. So you set your alarm again on your watch or your phone, and we go from here. You're going to jump in, jump up, shoulders back, back down, jump out, jump in, and jump back, squeezing through the abs. Okay, an alternative for that, you can just walk it in and put a jump on the top and then walk it back. Another alternative is just walk it in and stand it up, squeeze through the abs. You don't have to put the jump on it if you don't want it. Once we've done that, we're going to go squat press, 10 reps again. Drop down, touch, big push up above your head, sitting into it as low as you can, driving the arms up. Squeezing through the abs, breathing out at the top. After we've done that exercise, we're going to press up row. So from there, you press, then you row. One, two, three, and all the way up to ten. Again, if you want an alternative, drop your body in, onto your knees, squeeze up through the abs. Perfect. Okay, your final exercise from there is mountain climbers. So you're in the press up position again, and you're just pushing the weight over onto your shoulders. You bring your right knee into your elbow and back. Take your head with you, and then go to the left. So one, two, three, four, five, and all the way up to 10. Again, you're back on burpees after that, so you repeat it for 10 minutes non-stop. Your alarm goes, job done. And as you can see, I'm a little bit out of breath just from demonstrating those so, and it's about 100 degrees in here. <laughs> but yeah, well done. Enjoy the workout. You will be burning body fat for 48 hours after this, especially if you stick to the food plan that we've got in here and do the other awesome workouts. Well done, guys. That's the Inferno workout. Thanks a lot.